www.jennaplogs.com and today I have a tutorial on how to set up an online Instagram account. So this is Instagram here. Um, basically it's an app on your phone that you can use to take uh, pictures and then they have different effects for you to add to the pictures and then also um, you can share it socially on Facebook, Twitter, and a bunch of other sites. So it's a fun app. You'll need to first set up an account on your mobile device or your phone and then set up a separate online account. So this is kind of confusing so I'll try to explain it the best that I can but Instagram um, doesn't have their own particular site that allows others to view your photos. So I'm gonna click over to my test blog here so basically, if you want to uh, put a social button like Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest um, on your blog for your viewers to view your Instagram photos, you have to set up a separate account through one of these websites, and I'll show you those now. So the first one um, is webstagram.com. Um, and just a little note, there's many sites out there that do this for you. Um, but these are just some that I've had good feedback from, so I'm passing them on to you, and you can decide which of these you like the best. So you just have to choose one of these. So like I said, the first one is web.stagram.com. You can see that URL up here in the URL box. And I'll list all these URLs in the, um, in, in the post of the tutorial. The second one is followgram.me. The next one is, it's Statagram, but in the URL it's statiger.am. So S-T-A-T-I-G-R dot A-M. And then the last one is inc361.com. So you just have to choose one of these uh, URLs, whichever one works for you. The one that I've chosen to work with personally is web.stagram.com. So after you've made your account on your phone um, through the Instagram app, you'll go to one of these websites and sign in using your Instagram login information. So you can see here on webstagram.com, it tells you that um, if you're using this for the first time, simply use your Instagram username and password to log in. And then on the next page, you'll click Authorize to access Webstagram's features. So basically, Webstagram accesses your Instagram photos for your readers to view on their computer. So I hope that wasn't too confusing. Um, let me know if you have any questions. After you've set up your Webstagram account, you're, you will copy the direct link um, to your Webstagram profile and send that on over to your designer to link to your blog so that when a, a reader clicks on your this button right here, your Instagram button, they'll be directed actually to your Webstagram um, profile so that they can view your Instagram photos. I know that sounds super confusing. If, Like I said, if you have any questions, uh, let me know in the comments section of the post. And I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have a suggestion for a tutorial that you'd like to see, send it on over. Even if it's, you know, you think it's something that's, that's super easy and kind of silly to ask, please send it because if you're wondering, then I'm sure there's others that are wondering as well. So send it on over. I'd love to hear from you. All right. I hope you're having a wonderful day and I'll talk to you again next time. Bye-bye.